morning, guys. Thought I would do a little weekly vlog. It's actually Tuesday, not Monday, because I had to sort out some camera stuff yesterday. But we are here. I thought it was about time I updated you guys, if it wants to focus. Um, we are about... I should not do this, not over the sink. Hold up. We are now, like, Sunday is three weeks out. So we're just over three weeks out from comp. I honestly can't even deal with that. It's very hard to believe. The time has absolutely flown past. But, you know, I find it so funny. Like, I keep looking back on videos and I, like, my face to me looks normal. But it's actually so skinny compared to my normal face. And I'm like, can I please keep my prep face? But anyways, what to catch up you got, catch you guys up on. You'll have to bear with me because my prep brain is absolutely cooked. Hence the mumbling, the stumbling, the... Like, I have really bad short-term memory. But I'm doing my best. We're here. Three weeks. I'm actually just off to do my cardio. So cardio has not changed for a while. It's still five days a week, 45 minutes. Um, so I'm off to do that, and I'll get my steps on the treadmill because it's raining. All right, cardio is done. So 45 minutes on the stairs and then about half an hour of walking. And I've just, just popped into Woolies because I had to get some rice flour and I got myself a Monster because I haven't had any caffeine yet today. And it's like nine o'clock. So I sent my coach my check-in this morning. We got a high carb day today. That's why I had to go into Woolies because I had to get myself some rice flour because my high carb days are actually lower fats. So I can't have my oats in the morning because they're a little bit too high in fat. So I have rice flour, which are high in carbs. So I just got home and I'm about to sit down and do some work. Um, so I don't like to have like my full big breakfast as soon as I get home because my first meal is actually my pre-workout meal. So I like to kind of delay it until like 9.30, 10-ish because it's a bit closer then to when I train. So I just have a little bowl of strawberries. Normally I have a lot less, but high carb day. So I get a little bit more today. Here she is. It does not look that appetizing, not going to lie. Normally I'd make it like look prettier if I was going to film or take a photo, but I honestly cannot be bothered. But I am so excited to inhale this. It has been a little while now. Um, finished most of the work I need to do. So... I am going to go to the gym. I've got legs today. It's always the hard sessions that you're dreading are the good ones though. Remember that. But I'm actually like, I need the caffeine. But when I, whenever I've been drinking my pre-workout lately, like I'm so sensitive to everything. Like my ears, my smell, my taste, everything is super, super sensitive. So... I, I, I feel sick when I have pre-workout. Um, I'm going to have a bit of this non-sim pre, which is from Primabolics. It actually, this flavor tastes really good. It's just because I mix it. That makes it taste gross. Um, use my code Emma if you want to try out. This, very good if you don't like having caffeine, but any caffeine. Hey, we're back from the gym. Legs done. Feeling so much better. It's making my post-workout meal. Okay, don't judge me. My post workout has been a bit weird lately, but I promise it actually tastes really good. So it's egg whites, banana, cinnamon, um, and I'm going to put a little bit of cereal on top. That sounds so cooked. 
I obviously only get the cereal because it's a high carb day today. Normally I would not have that. Normally it's just egg whites and banana. I don't know what it is guys, but let me tell you, it is so good. I think it's like the cinnamon and the hot banana that really make it. I'm definitely though like, like this is a hundred percent my prep brain talking. As I said to you guys earlier, like because everything, like your senses are so heightened, basically anything is going to taste good. Um, so I'm going to make it and show you. And I don't want to hear any negativity about it until you've tried it yourself. So trust me. <laughs> Okay, here she is. I actually forgot to mention that there's rice in this as well. Again, this is only for high carb day. Normally it's just the eggs and banana, but we've added rice, we've added a little bit of cereal and a little bit of fruit. I'm actually, I have not tried this combo before, so I feel like it'll be good. The cereal's a bit like, not too sure if it's going to make it nice or not this would be really good if it was with like some almond butter or like some syrup or something but prep life i'm going to eat this do the rest of the work that i need to do today and then i actually need to go to the shops and pick up my glasses because i just got a message saying my glasses are ready to go pick up Alrighty, I am off to pack fair to go and get my glasses. I've also chucked on some trackies because while I'm there, I actually think I might get a massage because my dark, oh my God, I can't even like sit on my chair and work. Fuck, tag pies. Um, I can't even sit. Okay, I'm not joking, the magpies at our house swoop me and they're right they're right there they're right there hold up let me run ah! not the extensions they come for my hair because it's so long so basically the reason i'm getting glasses is because i actually have a prescription to wear them except both my two pairs have both broken. Oh, I just had to go back and get another eye test and get another prescription and I'm about to go pick them up. I've been getting a little bit of like pain in my eyes and in my head um, just from like staring at a computer most of the day. So I don't get that when I wear my glasses. So I realize I actually need to start wearing them again. So possibly the most stressful drive of my life. But let's go. So, just finished at Pack Fair. It is absolutely pissing down, and there is so much traffic to get home. Gotta admit, that massage was probably like the most painful massage of my life. I think it's also to do with the fact that, like, there's no like fat on my back. It's like she's just like rubbing muscle. This traffic is actually insane. insane. It's gonna take me like another like an hour to get home. Anyways, it's way too late for me to have free meals. I'm supposed to have free meals now. But I'm going to just have to combine two, which I literally hate doing because I don't, I just like to have my meals like evenly distributed rather than cramming them. When I'm drunk, you're my only type, yeah. Please don't break my heart. I know that you might, yeah. How are you about that life, yeah. Break up just to make up You're gone when I wake up Like who else likes Machine Gun Kelly because I swear I don't know that many people who actually listen to Machine Gun Kelly and I love his music Making up my dinner and it's the exact dinner I have every time Well, it's the exact dinner I've been having literally throughout this whole prep except I used to have beef mince with it, except I've changed it to chicken. So it's literally just chicken, veg, and some spud light. But my favorite thing to do is cinnamon on my chicken and my veg. I know, I know it sounds really weird, but get in there. 
It's really, really good. You guys are literally probably watching this. Like, this girl eats the weirdest food ever. You're not wrong. But also, that's kind of why being a bodybuilder. You kind of just eat for your macros. You don't really care. Good morning. It is Wednesday now. Um... I'm just getting ready to go to the gym. I have a rest day today, so no formal cardio. Yay! But I do need to get my steps in, and it is raining once again outside, so I'm going to go get them in on the treadmill, and then I have a posing lesson. Home! I am home. Oh, my ears are blocked. So annoying. But my posing lesson was good. Um... I'm definitely extremely, extremely exhausted today. Like, I honestly just feel like I'm gonna lay in bed for the next, like, seven days. But here we are. Um, I'm just going to <laughs> make up my breakfast. So we're back to our uh, low carb days now, but get more fats today which is great so I get some berries first up so I get a hundred grams of strawberries yum 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 I just had to pop to Woolworths to grab some because I didn't realize I didn't have any but 60 grams of oats I actually put my oats in the um in the oven so they take about half an hour normally I leave them in there for um I don't know I just kind of like randomly did it one day and I figured I actually really like the texture of them in the oven so now I put them in the oven oh the hardest part is deciding what flavor I want to do if you have not tried the primabolics um proteins you are missing out because genuinely they are the best proteins I have ever had in my life and I have been recommending them I feel like forever I absolutely just love them they're all just so good this one chocolate hazelnut and strawberry white chocolate are my favorites but honestly they're all really good there's like a cookie one which is like biscoff flavor there's um like a chocolate brownie flavor literally so many good flavors the worst part about going into Lily's in the mornings is they have like the fresh bakery stuff going and and it all smells, oh, so good. Fresh bread, hot cross buns. <sighs> and good morning, we are back in my car. I also am back with another monster, even though I just had that coffee, except it was like one shot and didn't do enough. So a monster is needed right now, but Feeling good. I woke up definitely feeling good this morning. Finished my cardio, did about half my steps, and then got my groceries. So we're off to a good start. Today isn't much of a busy day. It's a bit like yesterday. Um, just quite busy with work. Got a lot of check-ins to do. Got a few setups that I need to do. So I'll be working most of the day. But I think I might take myself to the cinema this afternoon. See how I go, see how quickly I get all my work done. But I also have an upper body session today, which is, oh, today is my favorite day of the week. I'm so, so keen to train. But anyways, I'm going to drive home because I am hungry and I really want my oats. Fast forward like eight hours. <laughs> I've been to the gym, I've finished all of my work for today, and I'm going to see a movie. I'm just taking myself on a little movie date because I feel like this is such a prep thing, but 
I cannot sit at home from now until dinner time is like painful like I'm so unless I have work to do I'm genuinely like so bored and if I'm bored I'm hungry so I need to get out of the house I need to do an activity I need to do something obviously the movie is amazing because I just lay there and I have no energy to really do anything else um so yeah I'm going to see the new Godzilla times Kong I'm actually really keen so I'll let you guys know if it's good Hello. What are you doing? Hi. Hi. Oh, we're all here. Puppy party. Kuma gets so excited whenever I come home. Are you excited? You're excited. Go, Kuma. Run. There we go. What have you got there? Oh, you got a bone. That's why. Get it. Get it. <laughs> They're so cute. Go, Kuma. Get her. <laughs> Kuma is snarly. Okay, that movie was so good. Like, I literally loved it. It was pretty. Please ignore the dogs. It was pretty actually intense. I was like, oh my god, Kong, do not die. But um, yeah, it was really, really good. Definitely recommend if you're into the kind of like action movies. So just gonna quickly jump on my laptop and do a little bit more work. Um, just like reply. <coughs> so kind to people <laughs> um and then i'm going to make dinner chuck the tv on and continue to be a little potato say good night good night night vlog kuma says good night from me and coombs we are on our way to Bali. just gonna go for a nice little walk and coffee down there here she is she hates the back seat in my ute because there's like not really like a stable surface for her to sit or anything so she always falls whenever we go around roundabouts and stuff but i try to drive really really slow so she doesn't fall but <laughs> um anyways i am really really excited i've got a rest day today which is exciting also got all confirmation from my coach about my mock peak week which is going to start actually tomorrow so what i'm going to do is i'm going to end this vlog after today and then start a new vlog for like mock peak week so that is exciting so look out for that we've got like high carb days high fat days training's a little bit different but yeah anyways let's go walk guys she is literally exhausted Anyways, walk done. We actually went so far, like nearly 6Ks, hence why she is so tired. But I just wanted to get most of my steps done in nice and early um, because I've got quite a bit of work today. I've got a few new girls that I need to set up, which is exciting. Um, but I definitely need to eat first and get some brain power going because I feel like I have no brain cells right now. My prep brain is, oh, it's really just irritating me. But anyways, um, so I've got that to do today. And then besides that, pretty chill. I actually don't do heaps on Saturdays in terms of work. Now what I'll do. Oh my God, I actually can't deal with it. Walking around the shops at like Easter time makes me so grateful that I don't work in a supermarket anymore. So I have just gone into the shops to pick up everything I need for tomorrow's high fat day or fat load. Um, so I've got like a bunch of eggs. Eggs is basically like the main source. I've got like eggs, almond butter, um, cashews, cheese, avocado. And I've like put it all into my fitness pal and I feel like I'm gonna just hate tomorrow. But it'll be interesting. It'll be cool. 
so I am keen but um yeah I guess we'll see how it goes but what I'm gonna do is I'm actually going to end this video here and as I said I will film a whole new YouTube video for like me <laughs> oh my god my prep brain for I'll film a whole new video for mock peak week there we go finally got it out hopefully you enjoyed and I will speak to you guys soon